Hi, this is John Kenilopoulos uh, from our center here in Athens, Greece, medical director of the Laser Vision uh, Clinical Research Institute and also uh, clinical professor of ophthalmology at uh, NYU Medical School in New York City, New York. It's been a pleasure looking back over these 15 years, the dramatic effect that uh, our original Athens protocol, a topography-guided partial PRK meant to normalize a very irregular cornea, there's an example right behind me, and um, higher fluency excel. Um, we've uh, introduced this technique about 15 years ago. We've treated uh, close to 4,000 patients now. Uh, we were very fortunate to have a close follow-up in all, most of these patients and we're able to share with you one, two, three-year data, 10-year data, pediatric uh, intervention cohorts. Uh, and this work that you're reading here is quite different. We're now looking at the medical parameters, the cornea and eye parameters. We're looking at the psychometric parameters. How did treating even one eye in these young patients was able to change their everyday life in work, um, uh, exercise, leisure. Um, these are entities that we were not very familiar with, so uh, it was a learning curve for us uh, to applying these principles, a psychometric test on patients that underwent the Athens protocol, some in both eyes, some in one eye. Uh, these were young patients suffering from keratoconus, and even in the one eye patients, the, meaning the patients would be treated in the one eye, the uh, morbidity from keratoconus in that eye was significant enough for these patients to seek treatment. Now, as a transplant surgeon of 25 years, I can tell you that 15, 20 years ago, the management for all these patients would have been a cornea transplant. We're very fortunate that cornea cross-linking is around, and we're also very fortunate that we're able to develop a technique that not only halts ectasia, but in a population as such um, in Greece, where contact lens wear is extremely difficult due to the weather and environmental conditions, uh, many particles in the atmosphere, a lot of sand, most months of the year, uh, a cornea transplant would have been still the only solution in eyes that have been stabilized with cross-thinking but unable to be rehabilitated with uh, spectacles. So the Athens protocol comes in to improve the cornea shape. Uh, this study shows how these patients were affected in a second psychometric effect. And I think you'll find, as we did, uh, the results extremely uh, impressive uh, and very gratifying that um, our uh, intervention in this very popular disease in Greece and most countries in this region is quite significant. It can alter these young patients' lives. Uh, nothing uh, is, feels more fulfilling than this. So I hope you find this uh, work interesting. This is uh, John Kenilopoulos signing out. Thank you so much for watching.